Nicole Scherzinger, hello. Hi. You were just saying that you haven't got wellies, or are your people going to find you some? No, they actually got me some, especially for this uh, event. I just have to put them on. I see that they're very fashionable. They are. They're, 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 they're on trend, I do believe, I, is I, the fashion I'm phrase. I'm noticing that. Everyone's yeah. wearing... What are they called? Wellies? Yeah, they call wellies. What do we call them back home? What do we call these wellies back home? We call them... Are they rubber boots? Rain boots. Rain, Rain boots. boots. It's, no, a, it's, it's, it's that galoshes. simple. Galoshes. We call them galoshes. Galoshes? Galoshes. Aren't they the ones that come up to your thigh? Oh, trust Nicole Scherzing to have thigh-high welly boots. That's very exciting. <laughs> Not complaining, I'll be honest with you. <laughs> so you've got your lipstick on. You're looking glam, but mentally... Your body clock is driving you crazy. Where have you just come from? Well, I'm a little jet lagged, but it's all good. I'm so happy to be here. I've been actually preparing for this for the past few days, but um, just finished shooting my first tipping of uh, X Factor in America and shot straight over here and worked on some new stuff to show everybody and get up on that stage in a few hours. No, it's just been uh, released that you're going to be hosting X Factor in the US with Steve Jones. How long have you known about it for? It's about as long as you all have known about it. <laughs> <laughs> because there was, a, there, was a lot of, there was a lot of talk about whether you were going to be a judge or whether you were going to co-host yeah. or whether you were going to be involved at all with yeah. the show. There's a lot of speculation going on about it and I kept telling everyone straight, I really don't know what's going on. I don't know if they knew what was going on and then uh, they had to start taping like immediately and Every, it all kind of came together last minute, and it's yeah. been really fun. I got to meet Steve, and now we're like bros. <laughs> yeah, you watch him. He's got an eye for the ladies. I was going to say, I can imagine that you became bros with Steve very quickly. <laughs> now, listen, I must say, I mean, it was terrible when our lovely Cheryl, Queen Cheryl, came down with malaria, but for you, that worked out beautifully because we got to see a different side of you. <laughs> I know it sounds bad, but you were like, woo, she's got yeah. malaria, woo! That girl's down! <laughs> no, I'm joking. But we, she's gone down, that girl. Uh, but we got to see a different side to you. Instead of just looking hot and dancing and singing, yeah. we, we saw a much more empathetic side, if that's the word, yeah. and a gentle side and a nurturing side. So you think that Helped. Yeah, it's hard to believe that I am human and I am a goofball <laughs> and I don't just loosen up my buttons, you know. No, like, uh, this is what I'm very passionate about. It's what I grew up studying was music and the performance, performing arts. So uh, anyway, I could be, like, um, supportive and, and, like you said, nurturing and empowering to these artists. Right now with my role, I look at myself as, like, an artist ambassador and I really, truly can empathize with them. I've been through that same exact audition process in the U.S. many years ago. And um, so it was a blessing to be able to do that on the show. And I didn't realize it'd be so well received. Yeah. Is it, is and it, also, you stood up one day and you did a big stand innovation for a while. And you had like a bodycon dress on. And you just yeah, looked they amazing. They painted that dress on. I was like, sit down. Will you sit down? Because my other half was like, whoa. <laughs> Are you going to wow them when you well, go on stage? There's music going on. I'm like, how can you not get up and dance during music? This is what I do. Yeah, do you know what I mean? It, is it going to be difficult for you as a co-host with Steve to, to watch the judges' comments and then watch the reaction from the contestants? Are you going to be the kind of host that will get involved and give feedback Definitely. to the contestants? Definitely. Def I've never really been a host before, so obviously I think they did that on purpose, and I'm not going to be a traditional host. I'm an artist. So, like I said, I've come from the artist point of view, and I could be um, I could stand for the artist and be an artist representative and ambassador. So it's hard because then they come off stage. I'm just like, I know what you're going through, and they'll say, what, what should I do next time? And it's just all positivity, and that's how you grow. You live and you learn and you grow. So cool. uh, Now, what are you going to wear on stage here in Carlisle uh, when you get on later on? Have you got a fantastic outfit to wow the crowds with? It's different. I'm, it's something I've never worn before. I had it made just for this show. Gloshes. <laughs> Thigh-high galoshes, yeah. actually. <laughs> and that's all. So stay tuned. <laughs> no, um, but I had it like designed for the show, and it got some couple of new things I've never done before on stage that I'm doing. So it's going to be a fun show for me. Yeah, the crowd will go crazy when you walk on stage because they're so receptive to every artist. You're going to have the best time on stage. Really? You really are. You really oh, are. That's good because that's what makes a great performance. Yeah. 
Oh, you wait. It's going to blow your it's mind. It's only a good performance when you feel their energy and you feel like they're in it. Then you're like, oh, are we rock stars tonight? Oh, we're going hard. Oh, yeah. Otherwise, you're like, oh, oh yeah. you feel it? are you feeling this? Is Do it? not leave anything in the backstage area. You've got to take it all. <laughs> um, all right. Thank you very much, Nicole Scherziger. So she's got to be on the big main stage wowing them. She's going to be doing things on stage she's never done before. Could be juggling. We'll see. Jumping through fire hoops. Yeah, with thigh-high galoshes. BBC Radio 1's Big Weekend.